Hi guys, how are you? Um, I'm sorry it's been so long since I made my last video. Um, most of you guys know I moved, um, a lot of things around the house are being fixed, and um, I'm having a bit of an issue with my channel, which I will get to at the end of this video. So let's get right to it. Um, I kind of feel nervous because I haven't made a video in so long, and I feel like I used to, um, I don't know, be on top of my game as far as explaining things in videos, and I haven't done that in a long time, so I'm a little bit nervous, so bear with me, just while I get back into the swing of things. So, as you guys already know, the title is above, and it is a requested video for Tonks from Harry Potter. Um, a lot of my Harry Potter cocktails have gotten a little bit popular, so, um, yeah, I'm just continuing on with that, and as I said, you guys send me requests. It might take me a while to get them up, but I will do them, and I promised um, the person that requested this, which I kind of forgot, but I will remember somehow, or you can tell me, and I will link it right there. Um, so, yeah. So, I finally got this together. So, okay. So, I hope you guys like this kind of, like, background thingy. I'm filming in my bedroom. I feel like the lighting is a little bit better. Um, so, yeah, let's get right to it. Well, you guys know Tonks is, um, in Harry Potter. Her hair changes, and I'm, I'm not very well, like, I'm not r super duper familiar with what kind of species she is and stuff like that. If she is a species, I don't want to sound like a moron, but, um, I watched all the movies. I love them. I'm just kind of obsessed with other people, so I don't know. Um, but yeah, her hair changes. So I wanted to make this cocktail super colorful and color changing, so as the steps progress, the water is going to look different. So for the bath bomb, we are using Fizz Banger, which goes from yellow to blue, and it froths away, and it turns um, the water like a deep green. Um, and for the bubble bar, my Dorothy's kind of look a little bit crazy. They're lightened up. They're still good, but... I mean, the color's kind of faded, but they're still good. So I'm using the Dorothy Bubble Bar, because um, that'll make it blue, hopefully. I haven't tried this out yet, so we're all going to find out together. Um, I don't know how blue it's going to turn the water, since it's really, really faded. But, yeah. For the bath melt, we're going to use the mm, Melting Marshmallow Moments bath melt. Um, so I don't know how this is all going to smell together. It smells okay. It's a little strange. But I feel like it's okay. Um, so that's what we're going to use. And you guys mentioned that you do like when I tell you what kind of shampoos and stuff to use. So some of the products I don't have, so I'm just going to mention them. Um, as far as the shampoo, I would definitely recommend Trichomania if you really want to get into this. It's a really moisturizing shampoo. It basically means like crazy hair or something along those lines. For the conditioner, um, Jungle is the most conditioning. And it's so cute. And it's colorful again, so that's nice. Um, I would either recommend Jungle or Retra because it's the heaviest out of the liquid conditioners and that smells really good. So that's about it for the cocktail part. The other thing I wanted to mention was I am unfortunately going to have to switch my channel over. So I'm going to have to figure out how I am going to like move my videos from this one to the next one. I have most of the originals, but some of them I don't have. So I'm going to have to figure that out. So bear with me. There will be literally, like, for sure, for sure, like, four to five cocktails up that are, like, super, super highly anticipated. So I'm super excited for those. Um, I won't tell you which ones they are, but look forward to it because I'm so excited for them. Um, it's taken a while to put them together. They are going to be awesome. So happy holidays. I am going to have some holiday cocktails up on the new channel which I will start putting a note on every single video on this channel to have you guys move over um, because I will be taking this down eventually. Okay, so my camera just cut off and I just wanted to say quickly before I take everything put it in the bathtub that, like I said, there's going to be a new channel and I will keep you updated. As far as my Facebook, I will link that down below. I'm having a bit of an issue connecting with everybody because um, my iPhone kind of only stores one Facebook account, and I do need to keep in contact with my family and stuff overseas, especially at this time. Um, so I'm figuring that out. I'm slowly learning how to use Twitter, um, so I'm going to link that down below too. I think that, that would be the best bet as far as contacting me because I can check that, you know, all at once with no issues. I'll keep you updated with the channel switchover, and let's go put this stuff in the bathtub and see 
what goes on because I have no idea how this is going to turn out. Okay guys, so I'm going to go ahead and put in the fizz banger. Sorry about the noise, the fan is linked to the light so we're trying to fix that. So they're two separate switches but for now just bear with me. ahead and put my Dorothy bar in. Um, I highly doubt this is going to change the color, but whatever. Go ahead and put in my bath melt. And since this bath is not for me, it's only going to be half full. So... I don't know why I'm crumbling this under the water. It's a bath melt. But I just want you guys to see like if the color changes, that's all. Honestly, this bath kind of surprised me because I thought that it wouldn't smell as good as it does, but it smells really good, and I thought the color would be more vibrant, but it could just be because my stuff is this color. Because when I put the bubble bars or the bath melts into those jars, for some reason the color fades away. I don't know why, but yeah. So that's it for the bath. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Mm. Melting Marth... Mm. Damn it. Melting... Marsh melting marshmallow moments.